The Live tab is where you assign Sample Tank 3 multis to MIDI program change numbers and manage your sample memory. The Live tab gives you a new object called a song that is exactly that, one song within your live set that might have several sounds within it. The intro might use a piano and bass split, the verse a string pad and synth bass split, the chorus an organ, and the bridge might use a synth lead. In Sample Tank 3, you use a multi for each of these sounds. Then you create a song that contains all those multis and their samples to keep the loading time to a minimum. Both songs and their multis can be assigned to MIDI program change numbers. First you load the song, then you load the multis within the song. Loading time for the multis will be extremely fast because the samples for all the multis within the song get loaded with the song. Let's create a song. First, enter the song name. We'll call it Song for Pablo. Next, double-click in the Song MIDI PC column and enter the MIDI program change number for the song. Let's use 1. So when you send MIDI program change 1 from your external controller, Song for Pablo will load into memory along with the samples for all its multis. Now we need to add some multis to our song. Song for Pablo starts off with a piano and strings layer. So let's put our multi called Piano and Strings Layer in the first slot and then assign it to MIDI Program Change 2. Double click in the MIDI PC column, type in the program change number, press Enter. The verse of our song uses another sound, a split with a synth bass and pad. So let's put the multi called Synth Bass and Pad Split in the multi slot and let's assign it to MIDI Program Change 3. For the chorus, we want to use a layered pad sound. So let's put our multi called Giant Synth Pad layer in the next slot. And let's assign it to MIDI program change 4. The multis within each song load extremely fast because the samples have all been preloaded with the song. Now let's create another song. We'll call this one Electronic Anthem. Double click in the song MIDI PC column and then enter the program change number. Let's use 5. Now we need to assign some multis. We'll start with our intro synth sound, the multi called Ambient Adventures. Assign it to MIDI program change 6. Then we'll add our giant synth pad layer that we used in the previous song. Here we'll assign it to MIDI program change 7. And then let's add that synth bass and pad split as well. Assign it to MIDI program change 8. We can continue this process to create several more songs in our set and populate those with several multis in each song. Finally, we need to save our live set. Go to the menu button at the bottom left of the browser and choose Save As. We'll name this set Friday Night Club Gig. You can create several different sets, each containing up to 64 songs, and each of those songs can hold up to 16 multis.